everybody welcome back Ruben with Texas all water fishing and today I want to talk to you about small businesses you know one of the things that I really like to do is help and support some of the small businesses that we have around in our area that's part of the reason why I like to go to some of these fishing shows and some of these fishing expos not only just to bring you the information on what's going on out there but also to introduce you to some of what these small companies and small business maybe introduce you to something that you didn't realize that we had in our own backyard here in Texas. Now, one of the companies that I quickly fell in love with and I really love, if you check out their website, there is tons and tons of great products that they carry. It is Frio Ice Chest. Now, they are located out of Sealy, Texas. And, well, what do you know, the Jeff... The owner of Frio invited myself and Captain Cody Gundun to take a drive out to Sealy and kind of pull back the curtain and show us what Frio Ice Chest really has to offer. Hey guys, Jeff Brands here with Frio Ice Chest. Uh, fighting the rain a little bit, but we have our booth set up, our new Frio trailer here. Lots of cool products. Price to sell. Come see us here at the show. Check out our booth. You want to look at the booth real quick? Yeah. Take a look. Yeah. We have pull top with our 360 speakers, detachable Bluetooth, turn it on, Bluetooth rechargeable, waterproof, really cool. Of course we have our Frio 24-7s with the bottle opener on the bottom, we have a powder coat wrap. Put some registration marks on there, then the cutter can read those registrations and line it up and cut it. Oh, okay. Sleeves of the material. Really? No. Yeah. It's like a sleeve. Really? Yeah. You can touch it? Yeah, you can touch it. It's some paper. Mm. A special transfer paper just holds the ink and then we'll go through a big sublimation drum. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It transfers. I had no idea. It that transfers. Awesome. It turns into a gas just ever so slightly. It turns into a liquid, gas liquid, and then it absorbs into the fabric. So it's printing the ink, and then you can see the UV lights are carrying it. And this right here is chloroplast, like 4 mil poro. So it just cuts it, and then they, these are like signs, you know, yard stakes. Mm -hmm. You put them in the yards and stuff like that. Like the sign stakes. That's clean. Yeah, yeah, super perfect cut. And then it, uh, they can, we can do magnetics. We can do uh, core glass, aluminum. The same we do for Sturgis. This point for aluminum for Budweiser every day. That's a pretty big project right yeah. here. Yeah. Um, Sturgis is real big. Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's Sturgis? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, magnets, um, packaging, all kind of packaging wow. and stuff like that. So, you yeah, turn a lot of custom work. You do a lot of custom, turn a lot of custom products? Oh, yeah. 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 No, 
I mean, it's like 600 orders a day or something like that. Average. Really? Wow, that's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> that's yeah, amazing. It's, that's it's, yeah. It's probably even more than that, typically, because yeah. we also fulfill orders for big companies like Zazzle and different people like that, you know, and so it's quite a bit of stuff. Yeah. Here, this is fabric we roll out, okay. and uh, this is how we make our shirts. So basically, okay. it starts in a roll of fabric. Then we have our templates, and we cut it, and then we go over to the sublimation right here. How many do you cut at one time there? You can cut however many. You can stick it. You can stack it this tall. Really? Hundreds. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So what they're doing here is sublimation. So remember the paper we saw? Uh huh. So you can see how the paper stacked here with the product underneath. Uh, they're doing bags right here. See these are cooler bags. You can see where the speaker goes. Okay. Just like that's that. wild. Mm -hmm. But it's so into the fabric. And that's the artist too, right? That's his yeah, that one. Yeah. 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 See, how the, see how it goes into the fabric? Mm-hmm. So this is like, so in koozies, this is neoprene. So you have different, you know, regular foam or, and then you have neoprene. Mm -hmm. So the neoprene goes like this, so so it does a whole different kind of stick. Is that completed over there? Okay. See, that's how it's sewn. Okay. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. that's I, didn't they were, I didn't know they were neoprene. It's <laughs> <laughs> a good warehouse. So warehouse, yeah. Uh, a lot of inventory, shipping, receiving, or some receiving stuff comes in, basically where that truck is. A bunch of counting, receiving, and then <coughs> ninety percent of what you see in here is orders in progress. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So yeah, move a lot in the store. Huh? <laughs> all the stuff that needs to get done. Yeah, it's an absolute shit time. There's a lot of. There's a lot. Yeah. Now you see why I'm walking around like a zombie. <laughs> See where you stress. <laughs> yeah, all this has to go, and it's all date related. Yeah, every bit of it. Gosh. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. That is crazy. A lot of moving parts. No, <laughs> I wouldn't even even begin to think about that. Oh, wow. Beautiful. Oh, wow. See, so we did the really laser cool. on it and everything. Did you build that yourself? Uh-huh. Yeah, so yes, sir. How many a day? Huh? How many a day do you build? Uh, I could do about four from scratch a day. Three, three, four. That's awesome. That looks great. Oh, okay, I'm done. A lot of I like that. Yeah, a lot of technique. Really yeah. could do about one leg per day. I could not even get close. One leg per day. It, it took time to get it, but I got it now. We got it down. I like the drain too. It's a lot. Awesome. I, I cut yeah, all the wood. That looks and good. Start with the scratch yeah, on the pallets right here. Yeah, yeah and we got these little uh, cedar picnics up here that we laser too. We do cedar 24s. I don't have any samples to show you, but we do that. Man, I didn't know you did this in house too. Yeah, yeah. And these get lasered, so she puts it, sends that over to the laser, mm -hmm. it gets lasered, and then it comes back here to get finalized. Because you can't fit this whole thing in a laser, so we fit these panels. Yeah.
I just want to thank Jeff. Thank you very much. Thank you, Frio Ice Chest, for having myself and Captain Cody out there to tour your facility. I know you guys are extremely busy, Jeff. Thank you, thank you, thank you again. Thanks for the wonderful gifts that you gave myself and Cody, this custom 24-7 cup. Now, there's something in here, so I don't want to turn it upside down, but there is a bottle opener right there. This lid has two places where you can easily take on and take off your lid. Even the opening on there where you can take a bigger swig of your drink without the ice getting in the way is just great cup. I've been using it nonstop since I got it. But, you know, thank you again. Thanks for having us out. I know you didn't have to do it. Thanks for ripping back the curtain and letting us come in and bother you for the day. And everybody else, I want you guys to go over there. Check out Frio because they, Frio Ice Chest because they offer so much great stuff. Not just what they sell, but also the customized stuff. I mean, hats, hats, t-shirts, koozies, these type of coolers. I mean, these type of cups, everything and anything. They customize everything. They do it all in-house. They do it all right there. And their turnaround process is just so quick. It's just, it's really mind-blowing when you get back there and you see everything that they do from the hand stitching to the printing to the cutting. It's just the I mean, I don't, I don't know what else to say. I was really blown away and was really caught off guard on how much they actually do there in-house and how much they actually have to offer. But anyway, thanks again. Don't forget, check out Frio Ice Chest. You can follow them on social media. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And, um, yeah, that's it. You know, hopefully next time you catch me out there in the water hooking up and hopefully this type of segment y'all like because... I want to do more and more of this type of work, not where this is going to take over the channel, but maybe every six to eight weeks where I'm going to be able to go and visit a small business and bring it to you all so you can be introduced to some of the great quality works that a lot of these great individuals have to offer. I mean, what does small business really mean? It means that you're going to work your butt off. You're deeply, deeply passionate about the products that you sell. And you're right here local to us. So hats off to small businesses. Thank you again for your ice chest and Jeff. Appreciate you guys.